and much as always, you stay warm and dry as well. All right, our next guest has quite the resume of acting roles, having been a screen actor for 28 years now and playing in movies like Leatherheads, The Curious Case of Benjamin Button, and Talladega Nights. He could easily forget us back here in Alabama uh, in his home state, but he hasn't. And he joins us now to share more of his incredible career and his connection to the Tennessee Valley. Danny Vincent, welcome to the show. Thank it's you, such an you. honor. I hear your whole family watches every day. Is that true? They do and are responsible Hello, for family. me being here, as a matter of fact. Now, my brother has told me, my brother Randy has told me for years, or I guess two years now. Two years, yeah. That I need, a baby. To, need to come by when I'm on a visit. And um, he sent an email. and. Next thing I know here, I said, which I'm grateful are. to be here. We yeah. are so grateful. Yeah. You live in Florida now, but yeah. again, you're back home right now visiting family. Right, Tell right, us about yeah. your connection to the Tennessee Valley and how you made it big time. Well, grew up here. Uh, was educated every from kindergarten on up. Went to uh, college in Florence, University of North Alabama. Go Lions, more minored, Lions. Yeah, and uh, uh, minored in dramatic arts there. And then took a marketing degree, basically, and worked 18 years out there. And, uh, sales basically promotion marketing merchandising and then i guess the lord decided i was supposed to be doing something else and uh, at 38 years old i decided that yeah i'll be an actor in alabama that'll work that's and, yeah, great so. you just decided that one day you just were kind of like no, let's 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 take this path instead. some circumstances shaped themselves uh, okay and like i say it was uh, i didn't understand it at the time but i do now yeah so incredible well uh, danny it's so it's crazy because i was telling you you know during the break i feel like this is the dream that a lot of people secretly have right uh, especially as a kid everybody's like um, i think everybody i was yeah. like i'm yeah, gonna, gonna be a star you actually made it happen and again you, you've been in incredible films walk the line 42 yeah. um you know tell mm -hmm. us about maybe just some of your most memorable moments throughout your career oh well, i've had so many my goodness they're all uh, big parts even though they're small but i I just, you know, the character actor comes in for a week or so, does their deal, and then they get out, and that's kind of how I like it. I don't know, nobody recognizes me much. I, I get recognized now some, but <laughs> I can go to Kroger and nobody knows who I am, you know, and sure. uh, so it's, uh, but it, it's, it's, um, it's also become um, a, a job and, and, a, and a way of life. It's all I do. Um, I have a pension from them. I have their insurance. Uh, uh, the Screen Actors Guild is, is uh, thank goodness for them. Thank goodness for places like Atlanta. Uh, yeah. My timing was correct. Um, anybody out there that knows me knows that I'd never said that I wanted to be an actor and, and I never really aimed to do so. But like I say, I think I was really led to do it and uh, enjoy the work. It's very noble in a profession. You, you're on yeah. your own, basically. But uh, got a lot of help and a lot of friends. Um, uh, I'm, I'm uh, thankful for everybody. The, 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 the list goes on with, with you. And like I said, I told you I've worked in your hometown many times. Yeah, so. Charlotte, North yeah, Carolina. Yeah. That's right. Well, Danny, again, such a phenomenal career. We were chatting to you. I mean, you said you hadn't really had any kind of formal acting training. I know you said you were, no. you know, working a marketing job yeah. uh, and the Lord just kind of led you on this path. Would yeah. you say then it, it's kind of just a, a natural talent then of yours for people, well, you know, wanting to be an actor? How can they make it? Um, if if uh, you, any if I can make it anybody can make it trust me that's uh, but you've got to you've got to take the 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 the, the process serious um, you need an agent a good agent um, I can't get you in the movies um, I'm doing everything I can to get me in the movies but um, uh, an agent uh, you know follow the rules of uh, um, do a lot of paying dues uh, do some work that uh, doesn't pay you but mm. you're in you know, you're putting something on the resume and that's what they need. And they're showing, that you show that you're serious at it and people will take you serious at it. And next thing you know, they're, they're suddenly hiring you. It was commercial work and a lot of um, uh, music videos for the Nashville artists. I did oh, a lot of those funny. for years. And then finally the movies came and now it's primarily, that's all I do, that and TV shows. And, and I enjoy it, it's, it's great to, and I think too, growing up as a twin, I had an identical mirror to play with, and 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 uh, uh, if he saw twelve army men over there, I did too. So the yeah. so the committing of the role uh, is something that's always come natural to me. I have taken some workshops, and they kind of messed me up a little bit. All of a sudden, I thought I was an actor, you know, and. <laughs> So it's, the it, fame will get you, that's for sure. Well, but it, you've stayed it, humble throughout the whole process. It's just it? try to be natural with it, yeah, you know, and uh, be honest to the role. If somebody were going to play you 50 years from now, you'd want them to do you fairly. Yeah. So you do that. I've always said I'd play it myself. You know those little like fun questions, who would play you in a movie? I'm like, me. 
There's nobody playing me. I'd do it myself. <laughs> Danny, again, it's so great to just hear about your career. Top, what's been your top, if you had to pick a top moment, like a, your favorite role, favorite line, um, favorite set you've worked on? Well, I've told this story, but I got snake bit on the campaign with Will Ferrell and Zach Galifianakis. Uh, we had a, I was a snake handling preacher. And they were non-poisonous, but uh, we weren't supposed to get bit. But I got bit twice that day. That was oh, interesting. Oh no! But um, and working on one we just did that's coming out in June um, with uh, uh, Zachary Levi and uh, Zoe De De Chanel, I think. Is yeah, Zoe De Chanel. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and uh, uh, it's uh, Harold and the Purple Crayon. Watching the the the, the CG work that they're going to have to do in that, we had to, of course sit there and, and be part of it and technology has gone crazy since I oh, started. Oh I can only yeah. imagine. I can only yeah. imagine. Well yeah. Danny again this has been such an honor to get to chat with you. Yeah. Hey family who for everybody that's tuning in thank you again so much and welcome back home. We're honored to, uh, to have you here. Thanks. Recap for us if you will. I mean you said you got a project coming out in June. Where yeah. can we stay up to date with you and, and see all your future roles? Well imdb.com uh, is okay. about the best place to find all the stuff. I'm on Facebook Danny Vinson. Uh, right. I have a website dannyvinson.com. Perfect. All that we'll check stuff. back in. Danny Vincent, thank you again so yeah. much. Congratulations to you Thanks. on all your success. We appreciate it.